So today I'm doing something a little bit different. I'm bringing you guys out on the road with me. I'm currently in Brighton and I am at Churchill Square and I am going to be searching for the perfect Christmas ornament. Now some of you will already know that I am a Christmas girl, okay? I love me some Christmas and I know it's November but it's never too early to start looking, right? Hey guys, it's your girl Aisha Shasha. Yes, I know I don't have the one today. Today I've got Mr. Sarutobi Sensei. He is one of my favorite nutcrackers. It's actually my newest nutcracker that I've gotten. I got him from Poundland. He's so, so cute. Um, I thought I'd bring him out on the road with me today to try and find the perfect Christmas ornament. Basically, it's gotta be pink and probably have gingerbread involved somewhere. <laughs> so yeah, let's see what we can find. Am I gonna have to leave here with a new, look at the, come on, avocado on toast for Shane. Oh my God. Look at these. Oh my God. Oh my God, this bag. I already have a strawberry milk bag, but like I don't have a machine one. Okay, so I'm in Minoso and a lot has changed in here. I haven't been here for like maybe a year or so. Look at how cute everything is. Ah! Okay, let's have a little look. Okay, so I've just come out of Churchill Square. I couldn't actually film whilst I was walking along like the mall and stuff. Um, I did get stopped by security guard. It was like, excuse me, what are you doing? 
um, but it was all fine but they just said you can film inside of the shops as long as you have permission to but not like when we were walking out and about in the mall and everything um, but I saw some really 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 cute things now I think I'm gonna head to Home Sense and see what they've got there I don't know if I'll be allowed to film in there but hopefully <laughs> hopefully I don't um, get arrested <laughs> Okay, hands down, I could have spent a lot more time in Home Sense. I was there for about an hour and I probably could have been there for another two hours. There are so many gorgeous things there. I didn't even know what to choose. The prices are really reasonable. Most things that I saw were about $12.99 each. Um, some things were like $25.99, but decent prices for decent things. Um, I can't wait to show you what I did manage to get. But however, at the moment, your girl is hungry. Is that even in focus? I don't even know. <laughs> Your girl is home. I am warm, I am toasty, I've got my peppermint tea and I'm ready to share with you what I got today. So usually this is my little like pusheen cafe but you know, tis the season so the gingerbreads have come out to play, don't worry they don't actually stay there. <laughs> I literally just got them out of storage um, so I'll find somewhere for them to go <laughs> now I know that I said that I was looking for the perfect Christmas ornament um I ended up getting five Christmas ornaments kind of things so um, let me know what you think and which one that you think is the perfect one okay so to start off with I don't know whether you can really class these as ornaments because they're lights but they look like ornaments so I got these these are from uh, Miniso I think I called it Minoso <laughs> earlier on today I'm sorry I got them from Miniso um, I've already put some batteries in now the reason why I went for the pink and brown is because a that's all they had but also B <laughs> because gingerbreads um, and because most things in my kitchen are pink so it just went really really well and I want this to hang over my cooker obviously not very low but like just because we have like a hood and then there's space at the top there so I want to clip these to that so that they can just sort of hang over there 
Ooh, here we go. Let me put the lights on. There we are. Aren't they so pretty? Do you know what? Should I turn the lights off? Hold on. There we go. They're so pretty. I mean, I know you can't really see like the pinkness and the brownness. I mean, can you? Can you see the difference there? Kinda. Yeah, you can kind of see it when I push it right up to the camera. Um, but yeah, I just thought that they just looked really, really pretty. Um, even just without the lights, just as an actual, just sort of like decoration. I thought it was just really pretty. So I got these. Now next I got this from Flying Tiger. Now my friend Jazz, she literally sent me a picture of this and she was like, girl, you need to have this in your life. And I was like, oh my God, I have to go and get it. And I'm so glad that they had them. Look at this. Oh my God. This is just the cutest little thing. It's just a little like decorative little jar. You can put anything in there you like. You can put maybe a little mince pie. Um, what else can you put in there? You can put in some little biscuits, some little cheeky little sweets. I just, I like, I, I absolutely love tiny houses. I love, love, love tiny houses. And this just absolutely made my day. It's so beautifully made. Look at it. It's absolutely gorgeous. And this was, I think this was eight pounds, I believe. So that's not bad at all. The lights were three pounds something. I think that this was eight pounds. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm really happy with this. I love it so, so much. Now the next three things, they all came from HomeSense. Honestly, I could have stayed in HomeSense all day. That place is just filled with the stuff of dreams. <laughs> Come on, it's just, it's just so damn cute. Now, the only thing I would change is around the E, the R, and this R here. I would put this white outline that they've got going along here. I would do that around there as well, just so that you can properly see them. So I am actually going to do that myself. Um, but yeah, I just, I absolutely loved this. Like, I just, like, I could not, I could not leave it. I couldn't. It was $7.99. It wasn't on the rack when I first saw that rack. And then it appeared out of nowhere. And I was like, that's mine. Absolutely love, love this. It actually matches my gorgeous little donut Christmas tree that I got from the range, I think it was, last year. And it just matches it so perfectly. Look at this they just go together so so well so I was like oh actually I mean I know that my nails are in absolute state at the moment but it matches my nails as well <laughs> I didn't even think about that um but yeah it just goes together so well so it just goes with my life okay <laughs> next please forgive me but I couldn't let this go I just couldn't let it go I got another house I'm sorry I'm not sorry <laughs> look at this oh my god isn't this just so adorable now color scheme wise this isn't really me so i am going to paint over um basically all of it apart from the gingerbread but my goodness with the light as well let me turn the lights off so you can see look at this come on now i absolutely love little ceramic houses that um have a little light in because it just looks like somebody's at home is that weird <laughs> Do you know what? If it is, I really don't care. I don't care. It's just, it's just how I am. <laughs> it brings me joy, okay? This isn't actually ceramic. This is plastic. Probably actually, it could well be resin, actually. Um, but yeah, I absolutely love it. Like, love it to pieces. It's a really, really tough contender for the top spot, I'll tell you that. Okay, last but not least, I don't know if you're actually ready for this. Because I nearly screamed when I saw it. <laughs> little clue oh my god look at him on a snare drum no less look at this like isn't he just so enchanting i absolutely love nutcrackers right I love, love, love nut, nut, nut crackers, nut crackers, and I love the drums. The drums one of my favourite instruments ever. I used to play the snare drum when I was in a samba band many years ago, right? And um, it's pink. It's a pink nutcracker. Like I collect pink nutcrackers for goodness' sake, you know. It just, it just, oh, he just brings me so much joy. I've called him Maestro. 
for obvious reasons. Like, come on, I just, I just got to show you the snow again. Look at that. And also look at the teeny tiny little house and the teeny tiny presents. So adorable. $12.99. And he's heavy. He's really well made. $12.99. Not bad at all. The house was $9.99. The sign was $7.99. The, the, the little house from Tiger was £8. And the lights were £3 something. I don't think that that's bad at all. You know, I had about 50 quid to spend. And I'm really, really, really happy with the things that I got. I do think that the top spot is going to have to go to Mr. Maestro for me. He just makes me smile so, so much. <laughs> Look at him! How can you not? How can you not? Let me know what you thought was the ultimate Christmas ornament from this little bunch. And thank you so, so much for coming with me on this vlog. I haven't vlogged in years, so it felt super weird at first, but I'm really glad that I've, you know, dusted off the cobwebs. Let me know where you'd like me to go next as well, because I definitely want to be doing more of these videos. Right, I'm taking my cup of tea and I am off to bed. Take care, my darlings, and I'll see you all soon. Bye.